now we are doing exercise 1.2 question number 2 question find this is hcf okay find small ab this is represented for hcf actually and we are going to find this one a b this is for lcm okay and verify that and verify that small ab like small bracket into ab into big bracket ab like a b is equal to a b we need to verify this one for each of the following integer for each of the following integers so solution oh no question number one the question number two roman number one right so roman number one let me write down the question question is a is equal to four to nine a is equal to four to nine and b is equal to seven one five b is equal to seven one five so solution okay first we need to find hcf and lcm so how to find hcf which method shall i use let me use prime factorization method because the next question is also asking you that one so let me find out by using prime factorization method okay so 4 to 9 let me find the prime factors of this one so 4 to 9 so i can divide by 3 3 1 is 3 3 4 is 12 3 3 is 9 3 4 4 4 8 i cannot divide by 3 can i divide it by 7 no i cannot divide by 7 can i divide by 11 yes i can divide by 11 11 1 is 11 11 3 is 33 so i can write down 4 to 9 as 4 to 9 i can write down as 3 into 11 into 13 now let me find out 4 7 1 5 so let me take this page and write down 7 1 5 7 1 5 so i can start dividing by 7 1 so 5 divided by 5 5 1 5 right and 21 5 2 the 5 4 the 20 and 15 5 3 the 15 1 4 3 same number so we can divide by 11 11 1 the 11 11 3 the 33 so 7 1 5 i can write down as 5 into 11 into 13 okay and the previous number that is 4 to 9 i can write down as 4 to 9 let me write down here i'm just copying from previous page okay 3 into 11 into 13 3 into 11 into 13 so therefore hcf which is like uh, ab right so 7 like which is a for us Four two nine and seven one five. We need to find the HCF for this one. How to find HCF? I hope you know how to find HCF. Take the thing which are common only, right? So here eleven and eleven are common. So write down eleven and thirteen and thirteen are common. So write down into thirteen. Take only common and reject everything else. So eleven into thirteen, which is one four three. I hope you can understand this one. So this is your HCF. Now let us find LCM. Therefore, LCM. LCM of LCM can be written as like this, right? LCM. So 429,715. So how to find LCM then? You are going to take 5 here. No command, right? So no, let me start with 3 first. Take 3 right 3 into take 5 into take 11 11 are common right so out of this 2 11 take only 1 11 right and 13 and 13 are common so take only 1 13 now multiply all these numbers what you are going to get 5 3 is a 15 right 15 into 11 it will be 1 6 5 okay you just calculate it i hope i'm correct into 13 so 165 into 13 let me multiply 165 into 13 53 is a 15 
six three is eighteen nineteen five hundred five or oh, three hundred three four right so five hundred five six hundred six one hundred one five nine five fourteen six four ten eleven one two two one four five so the answer is two one four five so we got the LCM as two one four five so let me rough this one. Now what next? The question says you the question if you look question very carefully we need to find the product of HCF and LCM. HCF into LCM you need to find out and you must check whether it is AB or not. So let me write down what is HCF 143 so this is 429,715 into this one which is 429,715 right we need to prove which is equal to AB so what is AB so 429 4, into 715 so this one 429715 what is the hcf we got we got hcf as 143 right here so let me write down here 1 143 into what we got as lcm here lcm 2145 so 2145 which is equal to we must make this to equal so let me say let me only take left hand side man so left hand side i'm taking only left hand side first okay so what is the product of 143 into 2145 so let me calculate try it out once let me use my calculator and calculate you just you can just calculate okay you just calculate it in order to not to waste time and make video much longer let me just take the help of calculator so i got this one is 306 seven three five okay this is your left hand side now right hand side let us take right hand side right hand side is four two nine into seven one five so what will be this one four two nine into seven seven one five which is three zero six seven three five so therefore we can say right hand side and left hand side are equal left hand side is equal to right hand side hence proof i hope it is clear to you okay thank you so much we will meet in the next video